Okay, hey collective. Um, I went off camera to give you guys a general spread for today. All right, remember you guys, these are general messages. All right, for some of you guys, collective, if some of these messages could relate to you right now, okay? Uh, for others of you later on in the future, if you come back, some of these messages could relate to you then, all right? Um, so I need for you guys to accept and receive what's yours today. Um, whatever's not for you guys, leave for the next person, all right? Um, also, you guys, if you like the content, can y'all please like the video for me, okay? So we're going to go ahead and jump right into the cards for you guys, okay? Um, the first card we have was angel number 1212, okay? And it's for guardian angel protection and receiving a blessing, okay? So some of you guys are definitely about to receive some type of blessing, okay? I feel like whatever this is, this is some type of protection for you, okay? Some of you guys definitely could be seeing the angel number 1212 a lot, okay? Um, we have opening your spiritual gifts, okay? So for some of you guys, you definitely are um, could possibly about to open up some type of spiritual gift all right um for some of you guys you already have opened it up opening opened up some type of spiritual gift okay for some of you guys this could be some type of upgrade okay but i feel like this spiritual gift that's about to be um open for you this is some form of protection i feel like this is your ancestors and your angels um sending this this gift the spiritual gift as some type of pro protection for you guys okay all right um we have the passed over grandmother card that flew out. For some of you guys, I definitely feel like this could be a passed over grandmother who sent it in this um this blessing for you, okay? For some of you guys, you definitely could have inherited some type of spiritual gift from a grandmother. And I feel like your grandmother, for some of you guys, is passing this on to you as some form of protection, okay? Um, we also have the aunt card. So it could be an auntie, a passed over aunt of yours, okay? Um, we have the earth sign card that flew out. So this, this could be a, um, Passover grandmother. That's a earth sign, or you could be an earth sign. Okay. Um, and we have fire sign out here. So this, this grandmother could be a fire sign. This aunt could be a fire sign. You could be a fire sign yourself. Okay. But I definitely know that for some of you guys, you are receiving some type of spiritual gift. All right. As some type of form of protection for you. Okay. Whether it's, um, you know, some type of upgrade, clairvoyance, psychic, whatever it is, something that's going to, to help you. All right. To protect you. Um, we have the divine feminine card. Okay. So you could be a divine feminine that's about to receive some type of spiritual gift. Okay. Um, I notice a lot of, and a lot of my spreads, my divine masculines or divine feminine cards been coming out. Okay. All right. So, um, I know there's a lot of hidden enemies, a lot of people trying to, you know, take down or, you know, come against the divine masculine or feminine. Okay. So I definitely feel like this is why, um, a lot of the divine feminine and masculine cards are coming out. Okay. Um, it's a lot of masculines and feminines right now that are under a lot of, um, spiritual warfare right now. Okay. All right, so I definitely feel like if you are divine feminine, you're about to receive some type of um, spiritual gift, all right? And I feel like this gift is some form of protection for you, okay? Um, we have Aries out here, okay? It could be significant, all right? Um, we have the hidden. We have exposed, okay? It's a lot of things hidden from you, all right? And we have a family. I definitely feel like um, this spiritual gift that, that's opening up for you guys, it, it's going to expose a lot of hidden things, okay, around a family situation for you guys, okay? I definitely feel like you have ancestors and angels who are trying to send you this gift or open, it up, open up this gift for you to protect you for some of you guys from a family situation, okay? It's a lot of things that's hidden from you, but I definitely feel like whatever... Um, you know, spiritual gift that you are blessed with, it's going to expose a lot for you. Okay. It's going to expose a lot. All right. Um, we have the enlightenment card that flew out. Yeah. You're going to be able to get some truth. All right. We have the milk and honey. Okay. For abundance. Um, a lot of you guys are definitely about to receive some enlightenment around money. 
okay? And it's evolving your family, okay? Um, we have the abundance coming, okay? Some type of money is coming towards you. We have the lies and deceit, okay? And we have obstacles, okay? So I definitely feel like a lot of you uh, guys, especially if you're a divine feminine, it's it's been a lot of lies and deceit around some money, okay? You guys had family who was trying to cause some type of obstacles for you around you not receiving some type of money, okay? And I definitely feel like your ancestors, your angels are seeing this and they're going to bless you with some type of spiritual gift to expose these family members, okay? To expose what's hidden from you, all right? This is why I feel like you're being blessed with this, this spiritual gift, okay? It's it's a lot of you guys, your, your family's been really been deceitful to you. And I feel like it's around money. They've been causing a lot of obstacles for you, okay? Um, we have the number 33 out here that could be significant, okay? We have glow up, see? And we have the life path four. Very, very stable, very secure person. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> very secure person. Um, I definitely feel like whatever gets exposed to you, whatever truth that you're getting, you're going to go through some type of glow up. Okay. I, I feel like whatever this money is that's coming towards you, you're going to be very stable and very secure. Okay. And I definitely feel like a lot of you guys, you have family members who's been hiding money from you. They've been hiding, been deceitful around something. Okay. Like I said, they've been hiding money from you. All right. Um, and I feel like your ancestors are blessing you to expose these people. Okay, this is why I feel like some of you guys are receiving a spiritual gift. It's time to expose them. Okay, it's time to expose the thieves in your family. Okay, <laughs> we have the reaching out and then we have haters. Okay, I feel like these, um, then we have illusions that flew out here. I most definitely feel like for some of you guys, some of you already have opened up. Some of you guys have already received some type of truth. Okay, whether it came in a in a dream for you or you foreseen something but a lot of you guys already received some type of gift if not when you do receive this gift these family members are going to try to come in with some type of illusion okay they're going to be reaching out towards you because i feel like a lot of you guys you're going to get the truth about them and like i said for some of you guys you're going to expose them this is why they're going to reach out towards you but they're going to come reaching out towards you with some type of illusion okay um we have the isolated. This is why I feel like they're trying to come with some type of illusion. A lot of you guys right now are, I feel, are isolated from your family right now. You guys are in isolation from them, okay? And I feel like for angel number 444 for protection to fly out, I definitely feel like this is your way of protecting yourself or this is your ancestors' way of isolating you from these people is, is to protect you from them, okay? Because I definitely feel like, um, like I said, it's a lot of hidden things around your family, okay? And I feel like certain things been hidden for a long time, okay? And this is why I feel like your ancestors and your angels are blessing you with some type of gift for you can get the truth around certain things, okay? For some of you guys, you're going to be the one to expose them, okay? Um, we have the bloodstone crystal, okay? And if it's for draws off negative energy, okay? I definitely feel like a lot of you guys have a lot of negative people in your family. This is why you guys are isolating yourself from these people. This is why your ancestors have isolated just, uh, you from these people. It's They're trying to bring, come in with some type of illusion, a lot of negative energy towards you. And I feel like they are doing this because I feel like a lot of them know that you're about to get some truth or you have gotten some truth about this family situation, okay? All right? Um... We have water sign Cancer Scorpio Pisces could be significant here, all right? We have water sign that came out again. So it definitely could be some type of water sign involved in this. You could be a water sign or it could be a water sign family member, okay? Um, but just know, Collective, <clears throat> some of you guys are about to, like I said, are receiving some type of spiritual gift or upgrade, okay? And I feel like this gift is, uh, is going to allow you to expose and get the truth, around a family situation, okay? It, it's been a lot of, uh, like, deceit around your family. A lot of people have been lying and holding back around some money, all right? That belongs to you, okay? All right? 
Um, the next spread that came out for you guys was we have the motivated. We have love yourself first. Okay. We have the Archangel Michael for abundance, prosperity, and leadership. Okay. And we have they are a distraction. Okay. So I definitely feel like um collective, a lot of you guys right now are. I just feel like y'all are in the energy of loving yourself, okay? Loving yourself first, putting yourself first. I feel like a lot of you guys are motivated on just making money, you know, being, you know, getting your money up, being prosperous, okay? Someone's trying to come in and distract you, okay? All right? Someone sees that you're focusing on yourself, you're focusing on getting to your money or, you know, making money or something. Someone's coming in to try to distract you, okay? Um... We have their playing games, and then we have the passion card. So someone is definitely coming in with a lot of passion towards you, okay? I just feel like this person sees that you're not focusing on them. You're focused on yourself, okay? And someone's coming in to play a lot of games with you, okay? Whoever this person is, you you and this person could have had some type of passionate 11, 11 on the clock, like a passionate type connection, okay? So whoever this is, they're coming in very passionate, okay? But Spirit's saying they're playing games, Okay, they're playing games. Someone's just trying to distract you from you putting yourself first. You focus on your money on yourself. Okay, so so someone is trying to come in and distract you from that. Okay, um, we have the player card that flew out. So this is definitely someone who I definitely feel like you pull back from. This person definitely could have been some type of player. This is why you pull back, and I feel like you focus on yourself. Okay. Then we have the twin flame journey card. So, so for some of you guys, this is your twin flame. You could have pulled back from them because they were, you could have found out this person was a player. Okay. Had a lot of options. Okay. This person sees you focusing on yourself. Okay. They see that you're healing. Okay. They feel like you're moving away from them. So they're trying to come in and distract you, but they're just playing games. They're coming in with a lot of passion. Um, they're just trying to stop you and, you know, around, um, focusing on yourself basically okay um we have fire sign that flew out here okay so it could be an aries leo sagittarius you can be an aries leo sagittarius okay we have leo okay we have capricorn okay we have younger earth sign okay so it could be a younger taurus virgo capricorn okay and then we have the time to heal yeah, like I said, some of you guys are healing from a situation from a twin flame, okay? Like I said, you you guys could be in separation from your twin right now. Some of you guys could have found out this person was playing you or had other people involved in y'all's situation, okay? This person sees that you're healing, okay? Um, like I said, you guys took your focus off this person and start focusing on yourself and your money. And this person sees and knows it, okay? They're trying to come in and distract you from healing, okay? All right, so that's what I have for you, Collective. I love y'all. Bye.